before you start commenting all these horrible things, hear me out for a second. Open eye, through the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing. This video in no way is to hate on Daniel Stevie. I absolutely love him. This is not hating on him in any way, shape, or form. Um, this isn't even addressing any sort of problem about him. It's addressing a video that is titled The Problem with Daniel Stevie, which I posted on a second channel, which is linked down below, um, and got some really, really horrible comments on it. I'm kind of fed up with all these comments, so I kind of just thought I would address them all and tell people that they need to get their shit together and stop attacking people before they even you know, get the information. So I posted this video basically talking about all these problems with Daniel Seavey, basically saying, oh, his eyes are perfect, his ears are perfect, he's a perfect personality, he's just a perfect person. And that's the problem, is that he's so perfect, it makes me angry. Like, that is the whole concept of the video. And it's posted on this channel, not this one, on that channel, where I post all these other, like, concert videos and edits and that kind of stuff, because that's what I post on that channel, because why not? So if you want to check that out, it will be linked down below. The video will also be in the first line of the description if you want to watch the video and find out what I'm actually talking about. But basically, I've gotten... There's a lot of comments on there that are like, oh, this is so funny, like, I saw this at first, and then I was like, oh, what the hell, and then I watched it, and then I'm like, oh, I understand now, it's a joke. But there's a lot of comments on here that I'm just kind of annoyed about, and I just kind of wanted to talk about, because people need to stop attacking people before they get the information. Stop jumping to conclusions, stop hearing one tiny little piece of thing, stop seeing something and assuming the worst on people and attacking them. Because that's not okay and it happens way too often and I'm just a little bit annoyed. So I posted this video back in, when was it? October, end of October. And recently it just kind of blew up. It has almost 7,000 views, which for a lot of people isn't a lot, but for me, for something on this channel, is quite a few. Yeah, basically this video I posted a while ago and recently people have really been starting to watch it. And I just kind of wanted to address some of the comments that I've received. Um, I'm not going to say their names, I'm not going to insert screenshots, not only because I'm lazy, but also because I don't want to attack people because I'm not going to attack people and like these people are attacking me. Um, this says, what the hell is wrong with him? And capital Y-O-U, actually. First off, the issue with him, if you would have seen the video, is that he is too perfect. The issue with me is absolutely nothing. The issue with me is you jumping to conclusions and assuming things before you actually have the information. I've gotten a lot of comments on this video saying Daniel is mine. I'm sorry, 13 year old, Daniel CV is not yours. Um, it doesn't really work like that. Don't be like, sorry, but he's mine and actually mean it because guess what? He's not actually yours, 13 year old. And then there's some people who say like, oh, I've seen edits like this before. Um, congratulations if you heard the audio perfect lips which is totally fine if the rest of you is a little bit fucked up but the rest of you isn't fucked up is it rest basically this audio is not something that i created it is something that's been around for a while i found it on instagram someone's like oh someone should make them for all the people like i saw this one of like zach karen or something and someone like oh we should make them for the rest of the boys so i'm like you know what that's such a great idea i'm gonna make one for jonah and then i'm like i'm gonna make one for daniel someone actually just asked me to make one for jack so i'm going to make one for jack as well and then either corbin or zach after but who knows if I'm actually going to do that because they are quite time consuming finding all the pictures and editing it all, but yes. But yeah, so this person's like, oh, it seems familiar, like I saw none other things. Well, first off, I don't care. I've made this myself. I did not steal it from someone else. There's my watermark on it. Literally, my watermark is on the bottom. If you're saying like, oh, this person, you stole from this person. No, that's my watermark on it. That's me. There's no other watermarks. I made this myself on my computer with iMovie, like... No, I don't care if it's familiar to someone else because it's the same audio. And they're like, oh, it's familiar. Like, I, I remember from something else. Maybe you saw me posting it on Twitter. Maybe you saw me posting the Jonah one. Like, don't start attacking me saying that, oh, this looks familiar, like you stole this. It's not an original idea. I never said it was. So, stop it. Someone just commented a question mark. So I commented back to them saying, what? Because they're probably like, oh, what are you doing? Like, you're stupid. So I commented back, what? And about five minutes later, they subscribed to my channel. So... Welcome. There's nothing problem with Daniel. He's just perfect, but this video is so funny. So, so you understand that it's a joke? Then why are you still saying there's nothing wrong with him? It's clearly a joke. You don't need to make the statement saying there's nothing wrong with him. The wrong the thing that's wrong with him is he's too perfect. There is nothing wrong with baby CV. Watch the video. Someone else commented saying, 
He's just jealous, referring to Perfect fucking eyes. My heart melts when I look at it. Like, are you kidding? Are you, is this a joke? Are you Photoshopped? It makes, makes me angry. Point. People are saying he's just jealous. The person who's saying this audio is jealous. Well, guess what? The person who's saying the audio is not the person who made the video, not the person who talked about Daniel. The person who made the video or who made the audio is not talking about Daniel CV. I don't even know if the person knows who Daniel CV is. So don't say that this person is jealous because that's not the concept. Clearly it's a joke. Clearly I am not this man's voice saying these things about Daniel. That's not the way this works. If you looked at my channel and you saw that there was a Jonah one, oh, this guy said the exact same thing about Jonah. Like, no, that's not how it works. Common sense, people, like, come on. He didn't say any problems, to be honest. You're right, he didn't say any problems. It was a joke. Ha ha. What's wrong with Daniel is perfect. Nothing wrong with them, just talking trash. Great English, for starters. And second, the issue is perfect, and that is a joke. No one is actually perfect, okay? Welcome to real life. No one is actually perfect. Everyone has some sort of flaw. Daniel might be insecure about something, and that could make him imperfect. But guess what? Everyone is imperfect. No one is perfect. That's just the way this world works. So, being perfect isn't saying that, oh, he's, like, I'm not actually saying he has a problem because he's too perfect. It's a joke. Please grow up and learn common life skills. Someone said, if I had a clone machine, I would make so many Daniels, and I so agree with that. Someone else, in all caps, very angry, said, he's flawless, he has nothing wrong with him. So I commented back in all capitals, watch the video. So many people are saying, there's no problem with him, in all capitals, and I just comment back saying, watch the the video. What's wrong with you talking about other people? Look at you, idiot. What's wrong with you talking about other people? Look at you, idiot. One, that doesn't make sense. And two, this is three weeks ago and this is my reply. I said, what's wrong with you jumping to conclusions and attacking people without getting all the information? You clearly didn't watch the video and if you did and still feel offended, then get a sense of humor. Please. Thank you very much. Drop the mic. There's nothing wrong with Daniel. He's perfect. Daniel is my favorite. Congratulations. Watch the video. And why did that get 11 likes? Because people are stupid. And this is the first comment on the video. Last one I'm going to talk about. And it is by someone who claims to be in Zach Heron's lane. Um, okay, are I kidding me? Space question mark. What on earth is this? Is there a problem with Daniel showing expression? I see no problem, brah, hashtag Daniel CV fan. First off, this is YouTube, this is YouTube comment section. We do not need hashtags here. Those are not wanted here. So don't include them. Second, are I kidding me? 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 I don't know, are I kidding me? Who knows? Um. What on earth is this? This is called a comedy video. This is called a joke. Something that is supposed to be taken lightheartedly. Something that is not supposed to be offensive to anyone. It is 2018. Let's leave getting offended by every little thing back in 2017, please. Thank you. Goodbye. That's all. I was planning on making these for all of the boys. I've only made Jonah and Daniel. I was planning on making Jack, which I am doing, and Corbin, and Zach, but if people are going to get so offended over them and not be able to take a joke, then maybe I won't make them. I've had a lot of people actually tell me that they want me to make them um, on Twitter and Instagram, on that kind of stuff. So I was planning on making them, but if everyone's going to just attack me and get so offended over every little thing, then maybe I won't. Like, what's next? I'm going to make an edit of them, you know, growing up throughout the years and you know, to where they are now, and people are gonna be like, oh my god, I'm so offended, I'm triggered, like, you shouldn't have done that, you didn't give me a trigger warning, like, oh my god, I'm crying, trigger, 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 I'm so triggered, like, you didn't give me a trigger warning, oh my god. Like, honestly, what is wrong with people? It's so frustrating, like, no! Take a joke, stop getting offended, learn how to take things lightly. I get it, there's a lot of shitty things happening in the world, there has been recently, and there's probably going to continue being because the way the things are going, but guess what? You're not helping by getting offended by every little thing. 
things don't need to be, you know, offensive. Every little thing doesn't need to be offensive. Oh, you know, me you know, using this pointy brush this way is going to be offended. Like, people are going to get offended by that. Oh, no. Oh, my beauty blender, I'm going to, it has, like, a bunch of teeth marks in it because my cat bit it. I'm so offended. I'm triggered. It has holes in it. Oh, no. Like, get over yourself. Get over these stupid little things. And just, like, stop being stupid, please. It's so frustrating. <sighs> Can you tell I'm annoyed? Not even a little bit? Anyways, I'm going to leave it off at this. Otherwise, I could probably rant on for an hour about this topic. I'm just so frustrated with the whole thing. The Jonah one that I did isn't nearly as bad. The comments are still kind of similar, but it's not nearly as bad. Anyways, I'm gonna leave it off here so I can actually get ready. So I'm actually going to the movies tonight. I'm going to see The Greatest Showman. Let me know if you've seen that because I've heard amazing things about it. I've heard the soundtrack is amazing. I've heard part of the songs, even though I haven't even seen the movie, I've listened to the soundtrack. Track? Track? Soundtrack. Yeah, that, that's right. So, Yes, that's all. I have to go clean my room and do homework and stuff before I leave in like half an hour. So, I'm going to leave it at that. And, yeah. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up and comment down below any video suggestions you may have. I'm always looking for new ones, so let me know. Um, and if you want to subscribe, that would mean a lot. You can subscribe to this channel, or you can also go down below and subscribe to my second channel, which is my vlog channel, or my concert slash fangirl slash edit slash whatever you want to call it channel, where I post basically... I can go, I don't know what I want to call it, like celebrity channel, sure, that could work. I don't know, I post all my concert videos on there, which I'm seeing, why don't we, next month, so I'll post all of those on that channel. Um, I'm going to the Junos, which is a Canadian award show, and Michael Bluebly is hosting, so I don't know who's performing at the, like, the nominees aren't even out yet, and it's literally just over a month away, but whatever. I will see you guys very, very soon. I'm trying to post every single week, and so far I have done it, so... Yeah, I'm aiming for Tuesday. Sometimes it's going to go up on Mondays if I have it ready. Sometimes it's going to go up on Wednesdays if I procrastinate all day on Tuesday and don't actually get it up. So, yeah. And sometimes I'm going to post random videos on, like, Fridays or something if I feel like it. So, subscribe because there's going to be a lot of videos hopefully this year. Fingers crossed. I'm going to have a ton of VidCon videos leading up to VidCon and a ton of um, Disney videos leading up to me moving to Disney World for six months if it all goes as planned. Disney College Program is what I'm planning on doing. If you want to hear more about that, I'm going to do a full video about it. So subscribe if you want to hear about how I'm moving out of the country and working, doing academic training at Disney World. Just let me know. Anyways, I'm going to go now. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.